In this example, we are asked to give the equation of the line that is parallel to line 0x plus 4y plus 7 equals 0, and goes through the point negative 0.1, 3.1. I can skip ahead and just give the answer when I look at this situation because I can see that this equation does not have an x. Therefore, it is a horizontal line. Any line that is parallel to a horizontal line must also be a horizontal line. And the only horizontal line that goes through this point would have to have the equation y equals 3.1. So the answer will be y equals 3.1. But I have to find a way to justify this so that I can be showing my work and proving that I have a reason to come to this conclusion. I will justify it by going through the same process that I go through with an oblique line. First I need to know the slope of the line that was given. The slope of this horizontal line can be expressed most easily as 0 over 1. The slope of all horizontal lines is equal to 0, but I want a fraction m1 is equal to 0 0.1, m1 is parallel to m2, therefore m2 will also be equal to 0 over 1. Then I use this slope, 0 over 1, and the point that I was given to derive the equation. I get y minus 3.1 over x minus negative 0 0.1. Cross multiplying, I get 1 times y minus 3.1 is equal to 0 times x plus 0 0.1. Simplifying, y minus 3.1 is equal to 0, and this can be my equation in standard form, or if I want it in slope-intercept form, I have y equals 3.1 the same answer that I knew I was going to get from the beginning. This gives me the equation of the line that is parallel to this one and goes through this point, but it also allows me to show a justification, a proof that this is really the equation that I was looking for. Here's another example. Give the equation of the line that goes through one-third, one-third, and is parallel to the line one-half minus y over two equals y over four.